たの海落ちたカーブン拾い上げたとしてまだ先も来るほどはないそう手のひらの上の小さな嫉妬僕らの時間は止まったまま思い出すよ初めてあった季節を君の優しく微笑む顔と今過去に押し上げ二人に続く限り気づいた僕らの心はポケだらけだ重苦しく続くこの関係で悲しいほどわからない心愛してるのに離れたかいのに僕が言わなきゃ心にこしょうぶりの雨が視界もけ Okay, my computer just tried to restart itself without my permission and I nearly deleted a bunch of my work. Um, that was epic, thank you for that added stress laptop. I really needed that right now. So I said in my last video I'd set myself a weekly upload goal and I missed that goal again and in fact I didn't post this artwork for like until yesterday even though I finished it like over a week ago. And I want to talk about why that is. Uh, it's no secret on my channel that I have mental health issues, but those mental health issues affect me in ways that prohibit me from being as active online as I probably should be as someone who's trying to grow an audience uh, and make money off my artwork. So yeah, I, I have I have BPD, um, so I'm incredibly paranoid as a person. Uh, I take almost everything people say to me as some kind of threat. It's very difficult for me to get out of that mindset that that everyone is not trying to pick a fight with me or challenge me. Uh, I think that comes from just years of being in toxic relationships and toxic abusive relationships. But yeah, no, it's it's makes interacting with people online very difficult, especially when I can't see their face and see their tone. Um, so that's why I don't really like being online much and communicating with people online so I'm not very active in servers or DMs with people. If we're friends online you probably know that I just dip off the map for a few weeks at a time and then blip back like nothing happened. And that's mainly because I'm just overly paranoid and I'm overly analytical and I just find interacting with people very stressful. There's like two people on the planet that I can interact with and not be incredibly stressed out of my mind the entire time. And that's my boyfriend and my best friend. Uh, those two people, I can, I can, I can manage them. I can manage them. But everyone else, I'm on edge and I'm stressed and it's difficult. It kind of forces me to retreat into myself and be really quiet 
when I come home. And I guess it's because I'm introverted as well, but uh, that introversion is uh, exacerbated by my BPD. But I'm going to set myself a goal, and that is to upload weekly. And I'm going to really try and meet my weekly upload schedule. I'm going to really work for it. That is my goal. I'm going to try my hardest to get to that goal and finish it. And hopefully just having that one thing that I do every week will be the key to help getting me back to a productive state because I am very unproductive. <laughs> I'm very unproductive. Um, and with that, I would like to end that segment about mental health and I would like to talk about some fan art uh, and feature some fan art because I've actually been getting a lot of it recently. <laughs> so I am getting to all of you who've given me fan art. I'm going to get through all of you, but it's going to take me a while because there is so much of it now. Today I'm going to be featuring uh, by Squishy Bugs, and I'm looking at their Instagram now, and it says they've moved. So if I'm saying if I put in the wrong name in there, I'll put the correct name on the screen. But this is by Squishy Bugs, and it's actually a redraw of some art they did for me in the past, and they drew it of my persona Marshall, and I absolutely love this art. I have it in my toy house, and it's just so cute. The original was really cute; it was adorable. But the redraw, you can really tell that they have improved in their, particularly their anatomy they've improved in and the way they draw fur have they've improved in. You can see the different way they've structured the legs, like the front legs in the second piece have a lot of really good structure to them and I really like it. And they've also taken account for the sort of change in my fursona's sort of personality in over the year. It really looks good, it really looks like they've captured that moodiness that Marshall has about him and I absolutely love this piece. Um, it is super cute. So if you want to go and follow Squishy Bug, you can. I'm going to leave whatever socials they have in the description and on the on the screen. Uh, but yeah, thank you very very much for drawing this to me, Squishy. I really really appreciate it. Like, this is one of my favourite drawings I have of Marshall. I just I do really really like it and I really appreciate that you did a redraw as well because you, I love watching artists grow and change and see how they improve. So yeah, thank you very, very much for joining this to me. And if you watched the video all the way through, thank you so, so much. I genuinely appreciate it so much. You people who watch my videos to the end really, really helped me out to deal with that goddamn algorithm. So if you want to help me out more, you know what to do. You leave a like, you leave a comment, maybe hit subscribe if you want to say more. Uh, it's currently two in the morning uh, when I'm as I'm recording this. This is normal for me. But yeah, no, I'm sorry if I rambled, but thank you very much for watching this video. See ya. I don't fuck with anyone, I stay up in my home. I can do it by myself, I'll do it on my own. Paparazzi's flashing, I'm going anywhere they're aiming. I don't care about the cloud, it's paper that I'm chasing.